And more than 100 animals, including dogs and horses, are in protective custody tonight after being rescued from a farm in Hoe County. A vet tipped officers off. CBS North Carolina's A.J. Janneville has more on how the county is trying to keep the animals alive. Hope County deputies were still at the scene hours after they found more than 100 mistreated animals at a Rayford home. It was sad. I'm an animal lover myself, and to see those, those animals, and it, it's, it's like they were happy to see us. Dogs could be heard crying from the backyard, and horses chewing on grass were so skinny, you could see the outlines of their rib cages. Hubert Peterkin has been the sheriff of Hoke County for 14 years. He tells me this is one of the worst cases he's seen. If we had not gotten notification when we did, there would have been a lot of dead animals because we got some right now, we don't even think they're going to make it. 43-year-old Maureen Lee was charged with not only felony animal neglect, but also resist delay and obstruction. Sheriff Peterkin says he doesn't think there was malintent and just thinks Lee let things get out of hand. But there was a similar incident that just happened in Ho County. Peterkin tells me Lee would have seen that and could have requested help from law enforcement without facing charges. But there's no way she couldn't have seen what we saw. There's no way she could not have known these animals were suffering, dying. There's no way. It was there, right in front of you. Reporting in Hope County, A.J. Janivelle for CBS North Carolina. And Sheriff Peterkin tells us there are too many animals for Hope County to handle on their own, and the ASPCA will get involved. Health officials in Florida are investigating.